Hey everyone, I'm back to show you something that I was gonna do, I wanted to do since I bought the truck, but yeah, never got around to it, and I was like thinking, you know, I wanted to lower the truck because it's kind of too high for me because I'm like, eh, I don't do a lot of off-road things, I don't need any really thing, I mostly drive in town or somewhere, but sometimes I go, I like to go off-road or whatever it's pretty nice to have a little bit but anyways so this weekend i'm gonna go and lower it. my four inch lift but i actually have two and a half inch blocks in the back just to level it with the four inch um suspension lift in the front so i went in town we have a called the uh, idaho or let's see what crack out is called but idaho um, springs and overload but they and they make custom lifts and springs and all this and lowering kits and stuff and like that's so whatever it's cool but I called them and i asked them i was like hey could you make me a, a one inch block because they could either make a one or a two inch block and i was like oh i need a one so what i'm gonna do is um take out the two inch blocks in the back and then put these in these are one inch blocks like and they're freaking heavy like heavy metal like this is like a good 15 like 15 10 pounds i don't know 10 pounds maybe because they're pretty heavy but i'm gonna do that put these two this they're not tough country they're, they're just blocks that gave me to put them in but yeah there's two of them in there um, two but i'm gonna take out the Two inch blocks right there. Put the one in and then just lower my torsion bars. And it won't be a huge gap anymore. Because these are 285, 55, 20s. So it will come around maybe like probably to down to there to maybe my finger. There'll be a less gap, it'll look nice. But yeah, just came to show you a video of what I'm gonna do. And I'll make another video to show you how it looks.